Hey, what's up guys? In this tutorial, I am going to show how you can fix this error 0xC0007B. Trust me guys, this error is so much easy to solve. And previously, I made a video on same error and more than 35,000 people confirmed that this error is fixed. So there is no one or two steps to fix this. You have to follow all the steps in this video in order to systematic approach. So if you already done some of the steps in this video, you have to do all again to make sure everything going in a flow. And remember, do not skip any part, do all the steps in this video. And in the end, you have to decide either like or dislike. So without wasting more time, let's start. First of all, open the Windows menu and click on Settings and then Apps Option. Program and Feature and then click on a Windows feature. And here make sure you have checked both of the Windows feature boxes. So once you check the Uncheck feature, Windows will download the related files. So once these files are going to download, and just wait for file to install. Now open up the Google Chrome app and download DirectX 12. And as well as Microsoft Visual C++. To make sure these two files are working perfectly fine, Once you download the DX12 and Microsoft Visual C++, simply install these two software, even if you have already installed. So if you also get the same error, make sure to click on OK and just skip this part. All along now, simply install Microsoft Visual C++. Now download these files. Link will be provided in the description. And simply install the DX11 version. If the DX12 version gives you the error, Open the second folder, and here there is the old version of Microsoft Visual C++, and you have to install all of them. Once all of the file are installed, simply go to the Program and File option. and simply repair all the Microsoft Visual C++. So, what it does here, it fix all the cryptic files that causing this error. So, if you find this video helpful, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon.